dealing with. Uh, did you see him today? An idiot. I, oh I can't gosh. believe we have to deal with these stupid. stupid. Freaking students, man. Oh man, my stuff won't print off either. This is ridiculous. Oh, this being a, a teacher person. at this school. Gosh, it's hard. Guten Schriebe ist meine Tag eins durch mein Istvan kriegt Nagen nach Mähen uns die Stellen. None of you know what that means? Oh, come on. I know we do this your word every day. I'll spell it out for you. Schriebe mein Maya, Dienstag, Dienstag, Kritz, Kritz, Mähe, Schloch, well, eine Schlocher, Schlocher, uh, you all know what that means, Schlocher, good. Let's not take too long to get outside, okay? Alright, pack up your stuff, here we go. Alright, it's, it's a beautiful day outside. Uh. 18 degrees. Uh, well, you have your sunglasses, <laughs> your hat, and your coat will be just fine. Sammy, when we get outside, you'll be running the queue. Don't take too long. Can we bring oh. our Chromebooks? No. Obviously, writing with your bare hand on your knees is much more efficient than writing with a Chromebook. I have a bike ride to do. I will see you guys later. So the front of his papers. Um, what do you guys think of? Uh, did you guys do your study questions? That was done. Yeah, Heather. Heather. I love this. I love this. What is this? I love it. Fat time, Heather. What you got? Oh, that's a good point, Sammy. Yeah. No, that's a great point. You know, guys. I think we should kill Cardi. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, history. Oh, did you see my leg? <laughs> um, did we read the passage last night about, um, oh, hold on, I got a story for you guys first. Sammy. Tell us about the bears. Tell us, oh, about the bears? I don't know if you guys have heard that I like bears. But I really like bears, and I've got some stories for you. Ah, what the heck, we don't do history in this class. And then, that's all that happened. I mean, the third bear was finally dead in the fourth story. And my uncle, or whoever it is, just all the people coming after him, you know, they just, you know, bears. Really, that's, that's what happens. I thought we were supposed to talk about U.S. history today. So when we're talking about John Adams, um, when you read in your reading last night, John Adams, uh, he, you know- Wait, Mr. Really, Smith, Mr. Smith. Huh? I heard he went duck hunting on Lincoln's. Oh, duck hunting. That reminds me of a great story. Uh. Miss Gerber, um, I was wondering how big our group should be. Should be. Um, well, in the past when I did this class, we did groups of maybe two or three. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's a funny video, Sammy. I love that one. <laughs> so about elasticity. Um, oh, we're working on it. Working on it. Yes, yeah. Um, I was wondering, how would you explain the financial de uh, de deficits in Kansas when it comes to the quantity of rooms at the price and how the um, how we're going up from increasingly one, two, three, four, um, all the way? And how would you determine whether that's uh, elastic, um, especially during um, the deficit in corn? So are you looking at fourteen? No, I'm looking at sixteen. Oh, oh, let me. Let me.
Okay, so I think, um, I'm Ms. Gerber. Yes, we are. Okay, good. I'm on, I'm on application problem three. Yeah, application. All the other groups are on application problem five. All right, so it's on this. How are y'all doing? Good? Good? All right. Guess we're all away today. We're going to talk about Teddy Roosevelt. Hey, Zach, how you doing? Just so you know, people sitting right next to you, I give them total permission to draw or stick something in your ear right now. Wait, but what about 2008, Mr. King? Oh, we want to get into that now. Take the hats off, Zach, and, uh, or take your hoodies off. I don't really care, but <laughs> Ms. Miller walks in. Uh, it's my skin on the line, too. Oh, just remember, you have a history paper due on the 10th. So do we want to get into some history? I was thinking we'd do one of my personal idols today. Yes. I grew up in Providence, and uh, back in Providence, it was, it was just controlled by the mob, man. Sammy? How much governmental regulation do you think uh, was involved in the 2008 economic crash? Well, there's a lot of nuance to that. Yeah, but the short, you want the short answer or the long answer? Actually, you know what? I'll get to your question after this three hour lecture. We're gonna talk about FDR today. If you guys didn't know, uh, I went to college in Boston. Go Pats, fly back there for the home games, box seats. <coughs> yeah, you see my key ring? Boston Celtics. <laughs> Oh, no, your, your point's well picked, but we digress. Like, Wait, and then be like, and then be like, then I'm gonna raise my hand. Zach? Oh, my bad. Uh huh, uh huh. And actually, that's exactly what I thought too. Principles. Versus practicality, right? Exactly. Oh, uh, you guys mind getting the blinds? So when we're talking about principles versus practicality, um, with my massive pecs, Sean, we're talking about how much governmental regulation. So when we're talking about how much governmental regulation there is, all right. Yeah, Lauren, so go ahead and just uh, ask whatever you want. It's a good point. It's a good point. Yeah, and that's actually what I thought about um, Teddy Roosevelt too. That's my homework. Is that you know maybe this is more governmental regulation than there should be. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Seventy percent. All right, everyone. You can draw a pink purple platypus, Hagrid's hairy butt crack, a field of mushrooms with the king of the mushrooms sitting on a throne like this, and all his other serpents bowing down to him like this, and like a whole ritual fire, okay? This one I personally recommend, okay? You can also draw a robotic planet, okay? I wanna see the gears change though, because I think that's really gonna emphasize detail and all of that. You can also draw a chipmunk merged with a moose. They would be fused together. Uh, toothbrushes fighting with each other. Or you can draw either one of these. It uh, doesn't really matter. Uh, it's up to you though. All right, go ahead. We're gonna start in precisely 31 seconds.
Time to start out. Remember, be creative, be persistent, okay? Oh, Sammy, that looks good, man. It's looking really good. I like oh, how thanks. all those colors are coming in. Yeah, I was, really, I was really trying. You know, what, you know what might look good is if you, uh, if you start going like this, okay. you know, and okay. then something like this. What the? Uh, it, it takes a while, but. <laughs> and actually, you know what this reminds me of is they used to draw ears like that back in ancient Greece. It's pretty insane, actually. What's painting there, Sammy? Um, uh, I'm I'm painting Appa. You know what this looks like is the uh, is the African buffalo that went extinct about 42 million years ago. It's actually really amazing. So they used to oh. worship them. Yeah, and this um, little bulge on top. It looks like the, I, uh, I was, the sun god that they used to worship, and it's really I, interesting actually. If you go down there, there's still trying, some people but, left. You know well, about them, right? Yeah, it's so amazing. Like it's just crazy how they infiltrate our pol politics today. Actually. Yeah, I, but I, I um, needed. Yeah. Wait, Mr. I mean, Mr. our Mr. work Feldman. has been so changed. Right, forever. I was Let's trying to work do on a the. Whole on this. Wait. So, yeah, it's pretty interesting how. how... So, Mr. Feldman. How are you doing? Oh, just painting this flying buffalo. You know, I think you could actually add a bit of the shade right here and maybe just in this kind of general area. You know, I was thinking maybe like a giant uh, sun moon glasses with a bit of magenta over here and a bit of shade over here. And maybe, you know, uh, a couple of moonlights over here and I think it'll be good, okay? Okay. Some coffee. Uh, hola, Doña. Hola, Saki. I, uh, I, I kind of fell behind on the uh, Spanish project. I've just, yeah, I've, a lot's been going on, so I'm, I'm really sorry. Can, can I just have, like, a weekly extension? It's okay. See, you can have a little more time. Okay. Thank you, Doña. Thank you. Hola, Doña. Hi. Um, so, I kind of messed up again. I, uh, I, I, I've been working on the word adios. I've been working really hard, but, um... You know, I the senior thesis has been just really stressing me out, and I, I've just I've been falling really behind. I'm I'm so sorry. Oh. I just need a little bit more time. I'm I'm really sorry. It's so it's okay. You can have a little more time. Do you need any help with anything? Or? No, I I've been I've been working real hard though. You know, uh, it's just it, it's uh, you know, it's uh, caliente hard. Okay, so okay, that, okay. Thank you so much. All right, thank you, Donia. Thank. Hola, Donia. Um, so I know it's the end of the year, but I was hoping I could kind of turn it in, uh, maybe next year. Saki, it's been six months! Well, yeah, but, you know, I've been working really, really hard on it, and, um, I'm, I'm kind of hoping maybe September 5th I could, I can turn it in, 2020, 2021. If, if you get it into me tomorrow, okay, tomorrow, you'll get 105%, okay? Yes, yes, thank you, okay, thank you. It's very short. It's very short. Uh, do next Friday. See? And I said, we're like the hookers. Hey, no shit cheat. Today, Ben Carroll. Hi, hello. How's everyone doing today? We're good? Okay. Let's get it started in here. Um everyone say their names. Oh, I'm forgetting you in the back. What was that again? What was that again? Oh, Hannah. Hi, I'm Mrs. Franz Frogel. It's nice to meet everyone. Um, boys, chest up, posture straight. I want you to sing an F minor harmony. All right, I'll play the note on the keyboard. Da, 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 da. Uh, very close. Oh, 
Excellent job, Kyle. Aww. That was a great job. Oh, man. Edith made that was so good. I'm so proud of everyone today. All right. Class dismissed. Hey, Mr. Weeks. Yeah. Are you on the periodic table? Because you're sodium fine. <laughs> All right, guys, let's start class. Sam, you want to read? All right. We're enthusiastic. The world we can interpret as for what we're trying to interpret is based around the fundamental concepts of nothing and something. The whole is the part, and the part is the whole. All right, I'm gonna stop you there. I was only half. I was only halfway done. But don't chess players do this, Sammy? I mean, what do you, what do you guys think? Um, in the middle of the line, you know? We do. It's just. It's a different way of looking at math. You know what I mean? No. All right, let's take a break. Wait, but doesn't infinity, infinity make the universe an abstract? Oh, and that reminds me of uh, something Anna said about three and a half years ago in an extremely insignificant class that I just happened to remember. I'm talking about right here. Back to full IQ. Let's go. Coach, I sure, it was a good shot. Ah. Hey, cool it's basketball IQ. Okay, we go into this every game. He jumps. Just give me the just give me line. Hey, excuse me, please, please put your mask on completely. We're still in a worldwide pandemic. Hey, no eating in the class. No eating in the class. No eating in class. Where the fools? Oh, I found them. Now just go see her whatever you're doing. I'm not going to eat it, man. It's, you know, but you knew not to eat, and I told you not to eat, so you're going to have to get to me tomorrow, but you can take care of it tomorrow. Yeah, you don't need it. Uh, Rados? Can you tell me it's Rados? No. I don't, I don't roll over after a long day, I'm about to go to sleep and say, Honey, that was a B plus. Oh, no, 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 I, I didn't mean it like that. I didn't mean it like that. I meant the day. <laughs> That's funny, Sammy. And then we're running, right, we're getting closer. We're like, oh my gosh, guys, oh my gosh. Are we really doing this? We really are? Holy cow, holy cow! <laughs> <laughs> holy cow! What a rush, and then they won the battle.